Hi friends, I'm Ellie and welcome back to TechTrix channel. Today I'm going to show you how to color coding your data in Google Sheets. Conditional formatting helps you to easily focus on a specific area and make your data easier to understand. Let's see. Here I have a list of students' names with their scores. I want to have color coding for better understanding. To access conditional formatting, I should go to the Format tab, down here, Conditional Formatting. This pad will open. There are two tabs, Single Color and Color Scale. First, let's use Color Scale, which is easier. The Color Scale helps to apply gradient colors to a range, so I should select a range. I click on this icon. Now I highlight the range. Now I click on OK. As you can see, the data is highlighted with the default color. I don't like the green color, so I click on this box and choose yellow to white. Now you can choose min point, midpoint, and max point type with color. I select min point value white and max point color dark yellow. You should notice that the gradient color applies to only numbers, date, and also time in the cell. Now I click on Done. As you can see, the highest score is dark yellow and the lowest score is white. OK, let's see how to use single color. First, I should select the range. Now I should set a rule for this range. If I open this drop down list, you will see there are many different options. Here I want to have scores more than 17 to become red. So I choose greater than. Now I should type the value. Here is 17. Now for formatting style, I want to have red color. So I choose red. As you can see, all the numbers greater than 17 became red. Let's use another rule. This time I want to make scores less than or equal to 10 yellow. So I choose less than or equal to. Now the value I type in 10 and choose the yellow color. As you can see, 10 and less than 10 became yellow. Now let's try conditional formatting for text. I want the failed text to become blue. So again, I add another rule and I select a range. Here for format rules, I should choose text contains. In the value box, I type in the exact text, fail. Now for the color, blue. As you can see, the failed text became blue. If you find this tutorial useful, I suggest you first hit the thumbs up and then watch the playlist of Google Sheets. Have any question? Ask me in the comments and I will answer all of them. And do subscribe in case you're not subscribed yet. Thanks for watching. Have a good time.